So now in this video we will start working right on the UI in here. So we will simply remove that container from here and we will write scaffold, okay. There we go. Now we will simply wrap it with a widget, okay. There we go. And in here we will have a safe area. There we go. Okay. Now right in the scaffold you will have a app bar first or you can leave it now in the app bar there will be a title now in title there will be text ok and in text we will say something like dogs breed recognizer ok get x ok that's fine in here so right after this body and right in the body we will have a container now right in the container set the decoration first ok box decoration in here right in there image as you guys can see and then decoration image ok there we go now right in there there will be an image ok and asset image there we go now in there we will set the path for the image so right first in here assets ok and then slash sun ok and then right in here in the asset we will use that back dot jpg in here ok so simply write the name in there back dot jpg ok now right after this comma let's fit it box fit in there we will go with the fill that is fine here now let's call it down first now right after this box decoration in here you will have a child and right in the child there will be a column widget and right inside children now in there there will be a stake ok and right in the stake there will be children now in there we will have a center ok and in there child let's cool it down first now right in here there will be a container ok set the height first and we will set it to 320 and right after this we will set the width to 360 let's say or we can change it later recording to the design ok child there will be image dot asset ok now in there we will set the prime so write assets slash and and now we will use that image ok frame dot jpg ok right in here so write frame dot jpg this one in here now right after this in here comma now right after this center there will be another center ok and there child and right in the child will be text button there we go now right in there right on press as usual ok take this down and now right in here there will be a init camera that we created before there we go call upon that in here and now let's call it down first right after this there will be a child ok in there container and right in the container we will have a first margin let's set it first ok and add insect we will go only with the top ok so right in here top and we will set it to 35 final ok and right after this let's set the height and we will set it to 270 point oh. and width and we can change that height and width later recording to the design if it's not fit then we will come back and set it in here okay 
so don't worry let's go with the width we will set it to 360 pointer ok and right after this child and child there will be img camera they will create it there we go as you guys can see equal it to no ok if it's equal to no then in here if we will show a container in here ok and right in the container we will set the height first height will be 270 .0. and right after this width we will set it to 360 .0. and right after this child ok set the icon ok and in there icons icons as you guys can see we will go with the photo underscore let's see we will go with this one photo camera front ok or you can choose anything according to your personal choice ok now let's add the color for it ok colors dot we will go with the pink this one in here right after this set the size we will set it to 40.0 ok it's fine in here now in else right in there ok in here we will have that aspect ratio in here ok there we go the second one now we will take this down from here and we will remove that from here ok and in here we will write camera controller there we go then the value there we go right after aspect ratio there we go it's fine in here put a comma take this down and here child let's scroll it down first now write in the child in here camera preview ok there we go now in there camera controller ok it's fine in here ok Take this down from here and then in here comma so this one in here all fine here now put comma in here and after this we will have another center right in there okay so right center there will be a child and right in the child there will be a container right in the container set the margin first as in sec you will set the top to 55.0 ok right after this child in here and right in the child we will have a single child scroll view ok there we go now right in there there will be a child and right in the child there will be a text and in text we will have a result there we go now right after let's do some style and right in the style text style let's set the background color first and colors we will go with the white ok put a comma right after this font size we will set it to 25.0 let's scroll it down first now in here right after the font size let's set the color we will go with the black ok that's fine in here so now right after this text style as you guys can see in here we will have a text align in here there we go text align dot center that's fine in here ok now we will add the const modifier to the edge insects in here let's add it all fine in here ok so now you will simply go and open that android 
okay and right in the ape we will open that build.gradle okay open it go down and in here as you guys can see in here SDK version we will set this to 21 okay that's fine in here and also we will add the apt option right down in here so right app options okay and then in there right now compress okay so in there tf light is fine in here we will simply copy there from here copy it and paste it down in here and remove that tf it will be just light okay all good in here simply remove that builder gear from here now we will run the application just click on display button this will take some time and you guys will see the result It's working totally fine and that's it for this project.